What is up everybody, welcome into this new video of TechPress. I'm going to be showing you in today's tutorial how you can start a clothing brand, a clothing online store with just the most basic plan of Shopify called the Startup Plan. So this one is actually costing only $5 per month, but with the link that I'm going to leave you down below in the description, you're going to be getting a reward by, let's say like a trial version, but you want to pay for this three months of the Startup Plan for only one dollar which in our case is a really lifesaver so with that being said now that you have your Shopify store let's just get started with so as you can see here I am ready into my Shopify store this is something that we have just created totally from scratch so I can be showing you what we can do step by step if I wanted to get started with an online store you wanted to choose if you wanted to sell products that you are willing to create by yourself or you are actually willing to use for, let's say, for example, like a drop shipping, you wanted to send some print on demand or whatever. In our case, we wanted to make some actual print on demand. And to do some print on demand, we wanted to go inside, first of all, focus into your dashboard of Shopify. We have zero, everything is in zero. So we wanted to, first of all, focus into adding the products, right? So what I wanted to do is to go into the left pod hit into applications and go into all recommended applications. You can always follow the apps in sales channel settings and go directly into the Shopify app store, or you can open a new tab and go for apps.shopify.com. Here, I wanted to type the categories that I wanted to look for. In this case, let's say that I want to go for print on demand apps that can be helping me to do this. So for example, we have Gelato, we have Pixos, we have Vidos, we have Applic, we have Shine On, we have Printful, and truly, truly, there's a lot of applications that you can choose. Personally, we're gonna be using Printful because Printful, from instance, is totally for free, and this one has a lot, but truly, truly, a lot of products that you can use for print on demand. Not only product, but you can add much more. So once you hit into install the application, you can hit into open app. So this one is gonna be asking you to get started with your very first account of Printful. So what you can do is just to create one with the same account that you have chosen to sign into your Shopify store. Once you are signed in, you wanted to get started with adding a product. Why adding a product and not sending your store first? Because since we have already downloaded the actual printful application from Shopify store, this one has now been directly already been added from your actual uh, full into your Shopify store. So we can just get started by adding our very first product. So if you wanted to focus into only clothing, you wanted to go here into the branding option. You wanted to go here into men's and women's clothing. Let's say for example that I wanted to sell some t-shirts. So I hit into t-shirts and as you can see now, I hit into the elements that best suits for you. So in this case, this one has truly, truly a lot of colors. This one has much more colors and this one has a little bit less of colors. But since this one is a really great seller and the price is really low, we can choose this option and continue with this actual product. So I'm going to choose this men classic tee. And I'm going to check out that this product is actually working for me. If it is actually working for you, what you wanted to do is to get started with the uh, design of your product. First of all, I wanted to choose the colors that you wanted to see into your t-shirts. For example, I wanted to sell these maroon colors. I wanted to sell black colors, navy, uh, red, maybe dark chocolate, uh, maybe cardinal, and I believe that's it. So now I'm going to try to choose my design. So I click where it says drop design here. And what I want to do is to upload a new file. It is really important that the file that you're gonna upload is the one that has a PNG file. A PNG file is an actual image that has no background. So this one is much, it's gonna be much more faster to edit it into your printful design. So hit it to apply and your design should be uploaded directly as it appears in here. If you like what you're seeing here, you see it now into continue. Now it's going to be asking you to design or to choose the mockups of how it's going to be looking your products. So you can choose basics or custom. I'm going to choose the basics. 
And here into the basics, what I want to do is to only choose the mockups that I believe this one should be really helpful for us. For example, let's say that we can choose this one, we can choose this one, or we can choose this guy. You can try to use one specific color as, let's say this is like the primary main image. You can add more additional image. For example, let's say uh, we can add this one, we can add this one as well. We can add like a guy here and there we go. So as you can see, it's not looking that bad. Now I'm going to hit into continue and lastly, here's the part where you wanted to edit the product title. So men's classic T, here's the actual description. You can add your MPO uh, metrical here if you wanted to and import those collections into my homepage. Really, really important. After that, I'm going to hit into continue and lastly, just hit into submit to your store. But here, this is the part where we wanted to check out our money, our estimate revenues. Here, check this out. The printful price for each product, for example, the burdens of small products cost from $9.25 to 50 cents. So that means that if you wanted to earn a little bit more of money, you wanted to level up your money in here. So if you wanted to earn money by selling here these products, let's say, for example, that I wanted to earn 50% of all the actual products that I'm selling. And as you can see, the product doubles a little bit up. So I'm going to be earning this amount of money once I have made some orders. So if you're okay with that, hit now into continue. If you don't, just leave it like that. In my case, I just wanted to earn 5% of all the earnings that I've made here from Penful. Why? Because we are just getting started and we want people to trust our products first and try those. Later on, we can try to level up and scale up our products and our company and branding and all of that. So once you hit into continue, the print files into the store, the detail, the title, the images, everything is now being posted into the store automatically. This is the part that is actually really great into Printful. And as this product is being now imported, you can hit into add product and add more and more and more products. So once you have chosen and do the same process with all the products that you wanted to do into your Shopify, what is left to be done is just to customize our store in order to get started with the startup plan. I'm going to go into the little pod. I'm going to show my Shopify. Let's go into my products. And as you can see, my products are now been listed automatically. If I hit into preview on online store, this is how it should be looking my product. So as you can see, it looks, it does look actually well. We have here the add to the card, we have the color, the size, the quantity, everything looks actually really, really great. But as you can see, we don't have any kind of design. We don't have really anything to add it yet. So this is the part where I wanted to go into my online store. And here into your online store, do you choose your custom theme? Inside your custom theme, you do have the currently theme here, which is a spotlight. So I'm going to hit into customize and inside customize, you can just get started by adding your custom design, your branding logos, your different colors uh, and all of that. So as you can see, the actual startup plan is just to add like something really, really easy. But that doesn't mean that we don't have to, that we cannot actually do something really interesting into our actual store. So what is left to be done here in order to get started is just to add your custom images and try to edit it and make this design look a little bit more, uh, let's say, interested into your actual website so you can just get started with. And not only that, you can even add an application to sell this stuff outside the Shopify. For example, you can sell this from your Instagram account into your Facebook account, into YouTube account, and even into the Google Merchant Center. What you just need to do is to go directly into your app that Shopify um, dot com section. And here, what I want to do is to get started with the Google and the YouTube apps. If I focus into all recommended applications, I can add, for example, Meta. Meta is going to be helping me to sell products from Facebook directly into Instagram, for example. Um, I can use the application of Judge Me so I can add product reviews. So this is totally something that we can cover into a whole video of maybe like one hour or two if you wanted to check it out how to actually uh, do this from scratch into something really, really professional. But 
As you can see, this is like really, really easy, like a basic stuff from Shopify, but that doesn't mean that you cannot use this for other stops, other places into an online store of Shopify. For example, selling into Facebook and Instagram, selling into Google and YouTube are something more and more interesting to sell into Shopify. So a starter plan is more than enough in order to get started with. So with that being said, guys, we have not reached into the very end of the video. So don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you wanted to get started selling stuff today you just need to add remember to add a payment method in order to receive payments and for that you want to go inside the settings section go into your payments and here you wanted to enter the payment that your country can be enabled from your shopify into your bank account so thank you so much for watching the video guys don't forget to like and subscribe and hopefully i can see you all on the next video